Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And this is for, you know, the last half of July. We had a card fall out, so we're going to take that one. Anyway, not every reading is for you, so this reading may not be for you. This is for Capricorn. Another one flipped over in there. <clears throat> Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What do we have? Oh, we got, we got three. End of July. October. October is prominent. So you could be dealing with somebody that is born in the month of October. Could be a Scorpio or a Libra. Um, or something is happening uh, the, in the upcoming October. Or something has happened in a previous October that is very prominent for you. Fire strong emotion passionate love or hate you could also be dealing with a fire sign aries leo sagittarius something's gonna happen i feel like something's gonna happen in well it may have already happened in the previous october but something to do with the next october as well Ooh, casket someone going out of your life or the end of a situation so something is coming to an end or someone is going out of your life. Passionate love or hate. Could be dealing, I feel like, with a fire sign or a Libra or a Scorpio. So it could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Libra, or Scorpio. Something is coming to an end. What do we have for Capricorn? What do we have for Capricorn? Could also be dealing with a Pisces. Ooh, there's some sort of fantasy land here. Somebody is in fantasy land. Um, there's illusion, right? I mean, that's that's Cinderella's castle. That's fantasy. So somebody, maybe it's the Pisces, maybe it's you. I don't know. Somebody is in fantasy land. This is it's not all. It is is play. One more card for Capricorn. Looks like we're dealing with an older woman here. So there is an older woman here that is, I don't know if this older woman is causing problems. Now keep in mind, this could go for your person. Maybe you're asking about a person. You're asking about somebody, what's going on? You know, maybe this person has somebody in their life, they're in fantasy land and you know, it's coming to an end. There is some sort of lust here because there's this is only lust, so I don't know what that means for you, but there is something that is only lust. Um, something is going to change. October is prominent, and I feel like, um, I think that it has to do with an upcoming October. For some reason, I just, I want to keep going back to that. Um, strong emotion. Something is going out of your life, or this is the end of the situation. Something is coming to an end. What do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? But keep in mind, this reading could be for you or your person that you're asking about. What do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Emperor. Some of you are dealing with an Aries. Doesn't have to be. Um, but that is, that's, um, deserts you in the time of need. I don't know if you have a father that has deserted you. Doesn't have to be. We could have an absent father here. We have somebody here that may have abused their power or this person is not using their, their heart. They're only using their head. We have temperance which is restraint. Oh, we have the Empress reversed, mirroring the Emperor reversed. This ain't cool. So we have a couple here that are that are not seeing eye to eye. These two people are, they could be a power couple. They could be a power couple, but there's problems. The Empress reversed. So the Empress reversed is termination. It is, I don't know if it has something to do with the child. Um, Empress reverse is 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 a lot is in pain. Somebody is in pain. They're suffering. They they uh, but the temperance is upright, right in the middle. That is a card of refraining and restraint and um, 
time, needing to take time, needing to go with the flow, needing to wait, needing to wait and just allow something to happen. We, we have somebody here that is two people, obviously, that are not in a good place. They may be, it feels like this is a couple that it may be, they're meant to be together because the Empress and the Emperor are meant to be together. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Libra. Aries doesn't have to be there's, a, there's there's some sort of sadness here mm -hmm. death underneath the emperor death reversed seven of wands reversed high priestess Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Swords reversed, Magician reversed, oh, oh, let's see, we got one that flipped over, the overall energy, Six of Pentacles reversed, so that is lack of reciprocation, one-sidedness, not getting, somebody's not getting what they deserve, there's an imbalance here. Um, I don't know what the, what is going on, but we have we have an individual here that is very controlling, extremely controlling. Uh, likes to be in control, isn't very qualified, isn't experienced, is on the wrong side of the law, doing something that is against the law, or just isn't. There's no love in these cards. There's a lack of love here. There's there's uh doesn't mean that there isn't any in the future because temperance is a card of change okay um we may have somebody here that is highly 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 intuitive that is receiving some messages receiving some sort of internal guidance deciding choosing to be alone reflecting keeping to themselves there is a need to to, to tap into your spirituality to tap into your intuition listen to yourself listen to yourself only um, I feel like there's some 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 sort of unplanned loss, unfortunately. This is why we have the end of a situation. The magician reverse is an unplanned setback of some sort. I feel like there's going to be a change that you're going to need to accept. It may have to do with a very masculine energy. This masculine energy is uh, not doing anything, they're not taking action, or they have deserted you in the time of need, um, and holding on is getting old, this appears to be a dead end situation, this is, it, it almost feels like it's a disaster of some sort with the death card reverse, I feel like we have the end of a legacy here with the ten of pentacles underneath that death and emperor reversed, I feel like this is the end of some sort of situation that you may have been comfortable in, maybe even has to do with the sale of a home or moving out of the home or something like that I feel I feel the middle card is a seven of wands in the present position that is admitting defeat stepping down giving up giving up um, giving up the fight somebody is like I don't want to fight anymore I'm giving up this the seven of Pentacles I mean seven of wands reverse that's giving up it's, it is stepping down to fall from power to fall from grace or just deciding I'm not gonna do this anymore I'm not going to do this anymore. I do believe that there is somebody here that is, is nasty. I don't know who it is. This person is very cruel. They're cruel. They're nasty. They, they uh, are mean. Very, very, very mean-spirited. There's been a lack of clarity. There's a lack of acceptance of truth. If things are about to change, there's going to be a change with that temperance card. There's also a need for you to control yourself, okay? Things could get out of control. You may need to control yourself. I mean, anybody can take on the emperor or the empress energy. In reverse, this is like out of control. There's a need to control your emotions. There's a need to control your temper. Or there's a need to control yourself you know when you get temperance that's a need to to control don't go overboard you know there's a there's a need to um, you know accept something with grace perhaps and I don't need the strength card to see that you may need to compromise but I feel like there's there's two people here we have the Emperor reversed then the temperance then the Empress reversed so we have two people that are having a hard time compromising both very 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 stubborn 
okay? So there's a need to compromise. There's a need to blend to create harmony with somebody instead of fight, 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 fight. That seven of wands is right underneath temperance. That's fight, 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 fight. I feel like there's probably going to be some sort of... Uh, conflict with the seven of wands right in the right in the middle um somebody may be choosing to be single they may they may be keeping a secret they want to be single you know or they're just going to be choosing to go within to be single because they don't want to fight anymore um i also feel like we have somebody here that is going through a spiritual awakening um they may not know their value though they may not know their worth they may not uh uh, and that's why they're, this is happening, to wake them up spiritually. I feel like we have some, I don't know if there's a loss of a, of a child here, you know, uh, with, or, or a termination, a termination. Somebody, I don't know if somebody's terminating something. That could certainly be happening. I feel like um, the magician reversed is manipulation. It's a trickster, somebody with hidden agendas, keeping secrets. I don't know if you are dealing with somebody that is keeping secrets, Capricorn. Or like I said, this could it's underneath the Empress reversed, the secrets. Um, the, t the high priestess is underneath the, the Empress reversed. We may have a female here who is is either choosing to be single or this person, I don't know if this somebody is having affairs or what they're doing, um, but this person is very clingy, they're very needy, they're very high maintenance, they um, may be having problems with their children, somebody may be having problems with their children, children and it's not working out some, and it may be causing problems for you. The magician reversed is no, this is unplanned, this is... Uh, Lack of awareness, unaware. Somebody may think that they know it all. You may, I don't know if you're dealing with somebody that is, you know, they may be a know-it-all, but they don't know it all. They, they think that they're a know-it-all. You know what I'm saying? This is like, uh, you know, I'm very spiritual. I know it all, but they don't know it all. You know, they may claim that they do, but they don't. So I think that you need to be careful of that. Um, Queen of Swords reversed. That is lack of integrity. We have somebody here right now that is not telling the truth. That is, that is, uh, I don't know if this is an older woman that you're dealing with. We definitely have a woman here that is not telling the truth. I do think there's going to be a fight and you're going to, you're going to need to control yourself. So I don't know who this is. I don't know who this is with. You're, I think it's with a, it's with a woman, whether you're a man or a woman watching this, I, whoever you are, you're, there's a fight with a woman here. Um, Somebody may have a, a hard time letting go. They may have, have have a hard time letting go of somebody that they're dealing with. And they may pick a fight. This could be foul play even with the Seven of Wands reversed. This is somebody that is very vindictive, very jealous. There's jealousy here. Revenge, revenge. So I don't know if there's somebody that is, is revengeful towards you. And maybe they're revengeful towards you because you were chosen or you were picked or something like that. Because of a change that has happened. Somebody is having a hard time accepting something. Um... Magician reverse, master manipulator, violence. I feel like there's some violence here. I'm not trying to scare you. I do. Uh, may have something to do with a home. They, somebody could be coming to your home. Don't let them in. If somebody comes to your home, don't let them in because it could cause a fight. Um, there's jealousy issues here. Um, you have an empress in reverse that is very... Um, and the Queen of Swords reversed. This is somebody that cannot master emotions. Maybe in some sort of pain over a loss. And they're taking it out. I don't know if they're taking it out on you in some way. We have somebody here that is very, very intuitive as well. That may be sensing that, you know, uh, somebody is doing something. And they may cause problems. They may. That's what I see. I see. I feel like we have somebody here that is going to be doing something that is very cruel out of revenge, and somehow you. Uh, I feel like you need to protect yourself. I feel like you're going to be put on guard. You're going to need to protect yourself. You're going to need to defend yourself. Somebody. Uh, is probably going to get very very angry, um, and I think there's going to be a fight. 
I do think there's going to be a fight with this older woman. Um, magician reverse that is no it's no we have somebody here that has some tricks up their sleeve this is somebody that is very very secretive they are hiding something with the with the high priestess above that magician this is somebody that has been hiding what they know they've it's almost like they have been watching from behind the scenes observing they know what's going on and they're going to do something out of jealousy, out of revenge. That's scary. Strength reversed. Judgment. Judgment. This is consequences. It is the end of things. It is a life-changing decision. It is uh, acceptance. It is release. Making a judgment call. An awakening, getting an epiphany. The truth coming out. Truths being revealed. Somebody has been keeping something to themselves. It feels like they have been refraining themselves from exposing something that they know. And they are, I feel like it's about to be exposed and it's going to cause an uproar. I don't know if this is like a third party or what. I think we have a vindictive individual here who is extremely jealous that is going to uh, lose their temper. They're going to lose their temper. They're going to get upset. They're not going to be able to control themselves. This is a woman. You need to protect yourself. You, 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 you may need to walk away. I don't know what is going on. Seven of Wands reverse. This is a fight. It is extreme. I, and it is extreme. I think it is. We have a we have a couple here. Two people that are. I think that I think there's a change. There's an exchange here. It's like somebody is deciding to go for something better. It's almost like the ex is is freaking out. One of the exes. Somebody is freaking out. This is the end of things. So isn't that a casket? Judgment is the end of things. It's the end of a, a trial. It's over. This is the final verdict. There's consequences. There's karma here. Karmic consequences of some sort. Making a judgment call. There could be news of legalities that are coming up. We have somebody here that is um, losing it, <laughs> definitely. They're losing it. There's, there, I feel like there's definitely going to be a fight. Strong emotion, passionate love or hate. You know, and I feel like that there's both. I feel like we have somebody here that um, is passionately in love and they're acting in vindictiveness. Or the other one is acting in vindictiveness because of jealousy. There could also be a reconciliation here between two people which causes them upset. We do have an individual here who is unable to master their emotions. That is unable to control themselves. And they've been hiding something and it is going to be revealed because they're not going to be able to control their temper. It's just, it's just going to, it's almost like an explosion and I don't need the, I don't need the tower card to see that. We have somebody here that it has been in a place of illusion and I feel like maybe something is ending in their life and they just can't handle it. Could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have Leo. We have Pisces. We have Aries a couple times. We have Sagittarius. We have Taurus. We have Libra. Um, there's probably going to be a change in a living situation here. Somebody may be moving. 
They may be moving. I feel like we have an individual that may have felt like they were stable. They were in fantasy land, but there's no love in these cards, and that causes an ending. And whoever is experiencing the ending is losing their mind. Unwilling to accept change. I feel like this person has been observing the whole time and they know something and they're going to reveal what they know as well. So I don't know who that is. We have somebody here that is, is it's almost like they're getting their pride hurt. They're getting their ego hurt. So they, you know, act on that. Angry, angry. Somebody is, is going to get angry. This is some sort of, uh, there's been a delay. There's been a delay in, in movement, but things are about to change. Somebody has gotten into a relationship just for stability, for money, for something like that. And there's about to be a change. Oh, I knew it was about money. Four of Pentacles that is holding on for the money, holding on for the stability. Um, greed. We have somebody here that is very, very greedy, that is very, very selfish. That it is, There could be a, even a fight over money. May have something to do with a mother and a child. You know, greedy, greedy over money. Mother, father, child, um, greed, self-control. Uh, we have somebody here that is very selfish, lacks respect for others, just wants the money, doesn't care who they hurt as long as they get the money. Temperance is a card of, of taming yourself, though. You probably need to be willing to compromise, but there's two people that are unwilling to compromise, and it's going to cause a problem. We do have somebody here that uh, is not a nice person. This person is not a nice person at all. They're very, very secretive. They're shady. They have tricks up their sleeve. Be prepared. Get prepared. Now on the bottom of the deck, we have the Ten of Swords. This is the death of a situation. Is the ultimate betrayal. You know, somebody is feeling betrayed and they are going to act. They are going to act. This is this could be the death of a situation. It is I do believe it is. We have somebody here that does not take care of themselves. They don't take care of or they don't like the children. This could be like a wicked stepmother or something like that, or a mother that doesn't take care of her children, not a very good mother. The Empress reversed. That is somebody that is extremely jealous, that uh, is very controlling. We definitely have somebody here that is very controlling. Somebody that uh, a know-it-all. We definitely have a know-it-all here. That does not want to lose their power. This person likes to have power. And that's the only reason they're holding on or they're, they're doing what they're doing is to prove that they're in control, to prove that they have power. Keep your temper in check. Do not lose your, this person, your, your buttons are definitely going to be pushed. There's no doubt about it. Somebody, and, and this person may, is really going to push your buttons. Really, 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 really going to push your buttons. It almost feels like you're dealing with a narcissist here. Somebody that thrives on control. They got to have control. They got to be in the position of authority. All they care about is the money. You are going to need to find your mental strength and your willpower to calm, to remain calm, okay? You need to remain calm, remain calm, because, you know, that's the best thing to do. This whole situation is going to come to an end. It is. 
There's a secret that is about to be revealed. Maybe it's about this woman or this man. It could be a woman or a man. There's a secret that is about to be revealed. Somebody has been hiding something, keeping a secret. There's lies. There's deception. Magician reversed. Lack of awareness. Violence. No. No. Six of Cups. Six of Cups is memories. It's, it's nostalgia. It's memories of what happened. Reawakening of memories. So you, there could be some resurfacing of memories that are coming up with whatever is happening. There could be an unplanned loss here. I don't know what it, what it is. There's a need to accept change. There could also be a soulmate connection here where two people are coming together that are meant to be together. This is a renewal, a reconciliation between two people that have been separated for some reason. And this could be a past life thing. It doesn't have to be your ex. Six of Cups can be past life. Or if somebody has been fighting, there can be a reconciliation. There could be. Could have two people that have been, you know, um, not together because of a third party. And the third party freaks out because these two people are coming together. And I don't say that very often, but I do feel like there is some sort of soulmate connection here with the emperor and the empress. Absolutely. But I feel like there's some bad news. We get the page of wands in reverse. Okay, we got, we got a troublemaker here. I don't know if it's a Leo. Doesn't have to be a Leo, but it could be anybody. It could be a Pisces. Um, we have somebody here that enjoys the control. They enjoy the control they have. It could be a Sagittarius. They enjoy the control that they have over a person. And they are unwilling to accept change. They are holding on just for the stability of it. And there's going to be a fight. Or holding on just for the money. It could be a fight over money. A fight over possessions or something like that. We definitely have a very spiritual individual here. Who That may be the soulmate. The, the highly intuitive spiritual individual is the soulmate. I do see that we have somebody here, whether it's you or the person that we're asking about, that is giving up. They are giving up on somebody that they were holding on to for just financial reasons it's like i'm just i give up i give up six of cups reminiscing wreck i feel like we have a reconciliation between soulmates here whether it's somebody you know if you've been fighting with somebody there could be a reconciliation there's a reconciliation here but there is an older woman that is going to be causing problems Out of jealousy. Good luck.